Hi, I'm James Tetrov. And I'm uh, I'm, I'm Joshua Struska. <laughs> and this is our mo- first movie, Attack of the Toys. Oh, very, very first. The very first. Oh, look, our names. Yes, I like that font. Basically, we used a three-chip camera to capture all this, because that, that's the most basic camera we, we have here at yeah, the department. This is when we were just starting off. This is the hallway just outside. Yeah. Other people were do- doing, like, claymation and stuff. And we, we just decided to do live action because uh, it was more fun. I think it defeated the claymation <laughs> overall. Of a lot of people. Indeed. We, uh, we kind of wanted this film to be kind of like small soldiers, but we didn't really have the time to animate it, uh, animate it that much, so we just kind of did our own little version. Yep, step by step, picture by picture. This took only about three hours, you think? Two hours? Yeah, it took a few hours. A few hours? Uh, it wasn't a six-hour class, and... Oh, yeah, that was a long uh, class. Was, yeah, yeah, I remember. Like a six-hour class. And How yeah. long ago was this? This was uh, fall 2006. People and uh, the, box is, the box is next to the wall, but to get this shot, we actually moved it up and out. Yeah, and then I was just, like, laying down on my stomach. Ah, oh, see, look how skinnier I am, but with less <laughs> facial hair. Now I got, like, a mini beard. It's nice. Oh, look, that. there's my tank. <laughs> my, my, my wrestling figures. Slash the future... The future monkey named <laughs> Randall Lee. Oh yeah, this is, uh, I love my face expression there. Oh look, the, <laughs> all the toys have gathered in, in, into an army. Uh, setting up all those figures just for that shot. <laughs> uh, then we, had a, we had an original plan of having a lot more like, movements and stuff, but it would have been so much Yeah, we, we just decided to, the music really tells a story in this one. Yeah, you did a good job of uh, editing the music together. I was always impressed that first time. And this we just basically threw different <laughs> figures in front of the camera and yeah, took a picture. It's quite challenging when you only have two people and uh, this is when they're about to uh, have their way with you. Oh, this is like borderline rape, especially that scene. <laughs> oh, look at all my cars. And we just, basically we just took uh, just pictures, I think? Yeah, yeah it, was it wasn't, it wasn't one crazy. frame uh, video, it was just pictures. Uh, what, does he, what does what does the monkey have up its sleeve? Oh, I forgot it's a nuclear missile. <laughs> How long did you lay on that floor? <laughs> Probably thirty minutes. <laughs> that... oh, oh, oh. Nuts. <laughs> I remember when uh, she have subtitles. I nuts. didn't initially know your plan. Yeah, you were just laying there <laughs> I was like, just like, like, don't worry, and then, <laughs> and then you, <laughs> I just saw a bracket right after the camera. And then, right and then when you put it there, I felt a little violated. <laughs> And I didn't know you that well at the time. No, yeah, we were actually just like beginning to know each other. Okay, I need you to lay on the floor for 30 minutes as I put this rocket next to your crotch. Dude. This is supposed to be like a helicopter shot, like yeah, after I was just the about wreckage. To say, yeah, this, is, this is like the miniature <laughs> helicopter shot. Bodies ever. This is kind of what it, happens in all of our movies. Now. Yeah, we kind of go for the heart right this, at the end. We start to make people cry. It's such a good combination of what we both do. Got bodies all over the place for me, and then the emotional music. Where, and, oh, look, there's my shoe made a cameo. I think a lot of people like this yeah. when we first saw it, when they first saw it. Yep. We never made a sequel, though. I think the audiences are pissed off about that. <laughs> I, th- I think people cried when they first watched it. Maybe even Tony a little. And directed by Joshua Straka and Jimmy Tetra. That's where I used to use my Jimmy Tetra as my, as my directing name. And, and this went under my... My company's title. This is before Brave Animals Productions was even created. Thank you very much.